here we have an OE uh, AM rear shaft for it's for a 5500 series Dodge for uh, bougie concrete. Bill and Seth, I know them both. Um, so this isn't really about the bougies or their truck. It's more of about unfortunate rough handling that occurred. Yeah. The truck went somewhere to be worked on, apparently, and in the scheme of things, they needed to change the radio joint, and it, it got pounded. I mean, there's no real easy way to say it. I'm not trying to be a dub to anyone, but hitting drive shafts with hammers never ends well, and this thing was pounded. I have a U-joint or a yoke spreader tool that I made because this happens frequently, and I, I spread the yoke back out and get it back to its original dimensions so it can at least run. Um, Midweek combination of midweek holiday here. Uh, I didn't have enough 1550 series yokes on hand to build them a whole nother drive shaft. So I'm just, I got it going so they can have their truck back. And I know they use it for plowing and they use it for work. So I can build them another drive shaft in the future and have it ready to plug and play if that's what they want to do. In the meantime, this is going to run fine. Um, I got it. I really had to massage that heavily to get that yoke back to the original clip dimension so the u-joint would articulate uh, that the u-joint the way it arrived it wouldn't even move in one direction i mean it could have been welded in there it really wouldn't have been any tighter um so like i said it's just very unfortunate but i got it worked it back into tolerance so that it would behave itself and actually both ends the flange the flange was less so than the weld joke um, got a U-joint back in it so it'll work. Right now that's cruising about 2400 RPM. So it, it, this thing couldn't have run 25 RPM. So at 2500, uh, we're going to say that this is a win. And that's zero at the rear axle. That's dead flat zero. Zero at the transfer case. So we're going to just say that this is the Thanksgiving miracle. And uh, we'll pass this back to the bougie so they can get the truck going. And we'll talk about what the next step might be. And uh, happy Thanksgiving to everyone else.